Also, we have the classic end of the game scenes yet again. Oh, but first we have to have this chat with Lambda. You're more foolish than I thought, if you're willing to entrust me with your body. Once I take over, that which you call Asbel will cease to exist. Do you think you can return whole from such an ordeal? Yes, because I believe in you. On what basis? You don't need a basis to believe in someone. But if I had to give reasons, it's because you went out of your way to protect us. Also, you could have taken me over a dozen times by now, right? But you haven't. That's why. How foolish. Besides, I'm only lending you my body. And things that are borrowed must always be returned. Pa, do not lecture me like some mewling human child. It's got nothing to do with being human. It's about doing the right thing. And besides, you and I are sharing this body. Remember? We need to watch each other's backs in order to keep things running smoothly. The word fool fits no one better than the likes of you. Maybe Land is on to something. A man who trusts anyone based on nothing more than his own flawed reason. You humans continue to amaze. But I also see now that foolishness is a deeper trait than I once believed. Thanks, Lambda. I think. I accept your proposal. I will borrow your body and absorb the core's elif. But be warned, notable strain will still remain on your body afterwards. You had best prepare yourself. Got it. Thanks for all the help, Lambda. Sorry to hear, Genus, that Twitch is messing up for you. Have a good night and all. Hey Sophie, can't sleep? <laughs> I almost, I was going to my phone because I was like, where's my controller? To press X for the dialogue because I, I, I set my controller down because like during those scenes, you don't have to press X to advance the dialogue. I was just going to visit the others. Wanna come? Okay. And that was a... Let's go. That was the easiest question that Sophie had to answer. Kate Silverstein's a good voice actor. Like, I've been wanting to say this for a while, but I feel like the way Keith Silverstein does the voice for Lambda is a little weird. It's always stuck with me that, like, Lambda's voice is, like, kind of strange a lot of the time. But, like, it's Keith Silverstein, and he does really good in other games, like, uh, like, Shido in Persona 5. He also does Midas from Star Ocean 6. Um, I'm trying to think what else Keith does that I've played. But, um, in Tales of Graces, the way he does Lambda is a little, a little, like, jarring a lot of the time. It's something I notice, but... I don't think that's really, like, Keith Silverstein himself, because he's normally a good voice actor. But, um, like, I don't know. Just the way he does Lambda is a little strange. It's just something I noticed in the game. And I know a lot of people, like, 
there are people who like say the voice cast of graces is bad but i don't think it's bad i think the voice cast is great like they do really good some of them are like not the best voice actors but they do solid but if you were to ask me oh is there anyone you think doesn't do as good all the time it's probably lambda his voice is like it's inconsistent with like if it's like fine to bad but it also really hurts to say that because i know keith silverstein does good in other stuff he does Mostly Star Ocean 6, he did really good as Midas. And there's probably some other stuff he's in that I don't remember, but, you know. Now, let me just give it the old wham bam. What are you doing, Pascal? Okay, so I was thinking how unfair it was that Asbel had to absorb the core. So I've got a new plan. Say hello to Mecha Asbel. Don't know. What have you done? That's not Asbel. What? Oh, come on. It looks totally like him. No, it doesn't. But what are you planning to do with that exactly? Asbel, you gotta admit, it does kind of look like you. It does kind of look like Asbel. <laughs> Just have Lambda zap himself into Mecha Asbel here before he absorbs all the Elith. Just like, just add some color to it and it looks just like Asbel. The resemblance is uncanny. You can't deny that. You can't deny facts. How about it, Lambda? Impossible. He says no. Come on, Lambda. This plan is awesome. Fine. I guess it really doesn't look like you after all. I mean, just put some color on it and it it's uncanny. You think that's the problem? Well, Lambda's only helping because he likes you. I think it's more complicated. So if he doesn't like my robot, it must be because he doesn't look like you. Ah, uh, don't mind me. Your people have always been arrogant. Too much knowledge will not save a civilization. It can bring only ruin. And yet, you persist in believing your knowledge can aid others. Hey, stop saying things! Did you really think that was Asbel? <laughs> uh, I didn't say anything. Your technology is too primitive to stand a chance of containing me. And yet I am curious to see what your determination can accomplish. Actually, I just realized it, it makes sense Pascal doesn't know this is Lambda because I'm pretty sure no one else hears Lambda's voice other than Asbel. And probably Sophie. And obviously Richard. Give your all to the effort, child of Amarcia. Okay, okay. I'll stop trying to get you out of Asbel. I'm surprised you'd give up so easily. Oh, I'm not giving up. I just think it's time for me to sit back and see what Lambda's all about. Hmm. Maybe I can turn Mecha Asbel here into a weapon for tomorrow. Heavy foreshadowing. Pascal, don't forget to take a bath. Alright, you're just asking the impossible now. Yeah, yeah, I know. Good night. You're not gonna do it, don't lie. Hubert, what are you doing, my dude? By the way, I love this moment. Seeing the characters talk to Lambda is really, really neat. Well, I mean, Lambda talking to the characters and, like, having lines for them is cool. What's up, Hubert? I was going to talk to these characters in a certain order, but I don't think you can. You have to talk to Pascal and Hubert back to back. I think you have to talk to them in a certain order. Like, you have to do these two first. So, like, order is, like, out the window. So Lambda isn't enough? Now you have to take in the entire core as well? You know, it's the rest of us who suffer the most for your damn hero complex. I'm sorry, Hubert. I don't want you to worry. Oh, I'm not worried. I'll be fine. But if something happens, I don't think Sophie will ever recover. Isn't that right, Sophie? You're not just the Lord of Launt now, Asbel. You're also Sophie's father. So I hope you're strong enough to stay alive and face your new responsibilities. Hear me well, Lambda. 
If you refuse to release my brother, I will not be held responsible for the consequences. It's okay, Huber. You can trust him. So then, you would stand against me to protect this fool? Perhaps it is you who are the fool to risk your life. Still, reckless courage has its own kind of charm. I would like to see more of your idiocy. Depending on your actions, I might just have to show you my thanks. What is this voice? This isn't Asbel. Is this... Lambda? See you tomorrow, Huber. Um, yes. See you tomorrow. <laughs> Alright, good talk. Let me see if I can get any more figures. What figures don't I have? It's not... Oh yeah, library is where I want to go. I always, like, think to myself, I go to strategy. You don't go to strategy, though. You go to library. What dolls am I missing? Also, what materials am I missing? I'm missing these. Oh, dude, we're not gonna get this done. Because we need the three zone cage super weapons. I just remembered. I only got Disintegrator, Seven Star Dual Blade, and Soul Brights. We can't get 100% on this because I would have to get the zone cage stuff. Alright, well, getting this to 100% is, like, irrelevant. I would still like to get all the figures, though. We're missing Asbel's figure. And Mal. Asbel, Malik, and Richard. I'm pretty sure Richard's they give you at the end, like, from a chest. So let me see if I can make... I can't make Asbel or... Oh, wait, I need to make the figure. <laughs> oh, well. I, I, I skipped the step. Still busy, I see. Yeah, just tinkering with stuff for tomorrow. What are you doing up, little bro? You all worried about your big brother? In a way. Aw, uh, he's gonna be fine. I don't think Lambda's gonna try anything funny. But even so. I get ya. You never know what's gonna happen until it does, yeah? But gosh, little bro. You sure do worry about Asbel a lot. Stop calling me that. I'm a grown man. Why, even now I'm considering an offer of marriage. You're getting married, little bro? Aw, congratulations! Congre- No, that's not- I'm not going to accept. Well, how come? Because I- Because- Because my every waking thought is consumed by you. Um, yeah. I guess I kind of figured that. You, you did? I mean, well, that's not a bad thing, is it? Don't you worry, little bro. Oh, Pascal. What? Hey, I totally understand. You don't want some smelly friend stinking up your fancy wedding. <laughs> You're banned. So I'll take a bath and use soap and everything. <laughs> Hubert's face there. Okay, now let's see what you can do, Mecca Asbel. Poor Hubert, man. Hubert was trying to make the ultimate Tales of OTP come true, and he just... Pascal's just too much of a moron. Huh? It blew up! And I'm usually so good at this kind of thing. Oh, robbed of the ultimate OTP. Why is Grace's had to... Why is Grace's had to, like, tease me with these pairings? I might go into request. We don't need to do any more request. We're done with request. Let me try making the Asbel figurine. Oh, there's the Malik figure. So now I need to look up how to... I need to know what materials make. It's probably Demon Claw. Maybe. 
We got the Malik figure, and now I need to find what makes the Asbel figure. I might not have. It might be Deathclaw, but I don't even think I have. That's for Malik. Maybe Godwood? Alright, I'm gonna go out of my way to make sure we get, like, at least one Jade figure then. Because I wanna get, I wanna get all the dolls in the game. At least one of the seven of them. Tomorrow we risk all for our homeworld. Don't you two think you should get some rest? Captain, I can't sleep. Will you just talk to me? All right. You said you were scared of losing the ones you love, right? I know how you feel. I know it better than most, but you must not let yourself be ruled by fear. Let me ask you a question. What's the best way to be with those you love? To protect them? Correct. But to do that, you must transform your fear into strength. Fear into strength? However, strength alone is not enough. You must also believe in those you love and honor their feelings. The better you know a person, the easier it is to keep them safe. You are an ancient creature, Sophie. But in many ways, you are still a child. Maybe don't call her a creature? <laughs> Life has lessons yet to teach you. Some will be enjoyable, and some will come with pain. You must face the painful lessons and learn from them. It's the only way to grow stronger. When we have finished this business with Vodra, you will be stronger for it. And then I can protect you all? I have no doubt. Thank you, Captain. Same to you. Good luck tomorrow, Asbel. The fear of loss is strong in you. It is a fear honed sharp against a stone of countless pains. By showing these children the true path, you show it also to yourself. Fascinating. May your devotion to the path be a shining example to those around you. It's true. Perhaps they teach me more than I know. Captain Malik? Enough chatter. Get yourselves to bed, and that's in order. Yes, sir. Alright, just Richard and Sherry now. I think we'll do, um... Richard last. Oh wait, they might not let me. We might have to do Richard now. Alright. Oh, there's Mecha Sophie. Oh my word. Asbel, Sophie. Can't sleep, Richard? I keep trying, but I fear it's a lost cause. I can't stop thinking about tomorrow. About what I would do if you ended up like... Me. I told you, that's not gonna happen. Remember when we were young? It made me happy to know that you trusted me. When I grew up, I made one terrible mistake after another. But it helped me to know I could support you. Without that trust, I wouldn't be the man I am now. It's the same with Lambda. I need to trust him. I need to believe in whatever made him protect us. When Lambda was inside me, I... I was enslaved by him. I wasn't able to face him the way you can. We haven't spoken in a while. Richard, we used to feed off resentment, and it allowed our hatred to grow strong. We believed we could save the other from loneliness. But I don't need to tell you how that turned out. You and I are both indebted to this man. I will repay my debt. The path you choose is up to you. Lambda. Asbel. I just heard Lambda's voice. Sophie, 
I think Asbel and Landa are actually getting along. You won't have to fight him again. I've decided to place my trust in Lambda as well. Thanks, Richard. Can you hear me, Lambda? I know that I failed you. And so you may not care what I have to say. Oh, I love this game. I love this moment. Getting all the Lambda scenes is really good. So now we have to go talk to Sharia. And then we're all done.